If the point of having shot the film in black and white and using movie tone ratio was to pretend like this was filmed in the late 20s, they could have done a lot better by using a more theatrical style of acting and maybe messing a bit more with the image quality and cinematography as it looks very clean. The artists did a very similar thing a few years back way better. I'm a huge fan of films with a limited cast as it allows the story to take a breath and slowly expand on the characters and themes instead of cobbling together a bunch of plot threads and ooh look at there, there's another plot thread, isn't this exciting? The the camera is moving around the room and the characters are shouting, this means things are happening, I can hardly hold my breath, someone opened up a window and cleaned the sewage. And someone did. The film is entirely carried by one great and one good actor. Both of them have scenes where they shine and do a good job at hypnotizing you with just their eyes, yet Green Goblin clearly still shows that he's much more experienced of an actor than Sparkly Vampire, as illustrated by the scene where the foe transforms his face and physique into a barely recognizable as human shape using nothing but his eyes and the tone of his voice, summoning Poseidon himself and all Mr. Sparkly can do is say, I am not fucking drunk. Though, as I said, he has his own scene to shine too. But both men are helped tremendously by every great photography trick in the book. Negative space, high contrast, frame within frame, objects in front and the back of the shot, dynamic lighting, shadow placement, center shot, rule of thirds, symmetry, spirals, circles, rectangles, close-ups, full shots and the occasional off shot to throw you out of your comfort zone. This film does everything and so much more which normally would give it a very artificial look. And it does so too, but so what when it does it so well? And the story will keep you guessing until the very end, just like whether or not you will check out my other videos, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, thanks!